Hey, you guys want to come work at a better store and get paid more? How much you guys get paid per hour, man? Um, seven thousand. All right, listen, let's cut a boost it. Right, we both know your ass don't make no seven thousand per hour. <laughs> I know you for a me. fact. I know you for a me. fact they paying your ass pennies on the dollar over here, man. You all doing this shit for free, bro? How much Is you get paid for, for real? Taco shop? How much you guys get paid for real, man? Let's be. Let's just shoot straight with me, man. Come on. Um, straight from the hip. Hey, how much am I? Are you $2,000? $2,000 an hour? Yeah. And you shooting straight? You being honest? Hey. I'm being so honest. Yeah. $2,000, bro. You could. What the hell is two thousand? What you gonna do with two thousand dollars? What are you gonna do with For that? For real, right? I'm just kidding. <laughs> bro, y'all motherfuckers working minimum yeah, wage yeah. over here, man. Minimum wage. Wait, wait, right, I have a question. Dude. What's up, I have a Shana? question. So, would you be fine, like, to work in multiple stalls? Or like, is that like a no, no? Yeah. Hmm. Right. Actually, that's a good question, Cal. You answer that. You can work multiple stalls. Yeah. Well, hold on. Let me, uh... um. Yeah. Wait, Cal. Can I? Can I talk to you? Privately? Oh, sure. Oh. Listen, listen, man. All I'm saying is, I, I'm one of the new managers at a taco place. Mm, you know, okay. Not only do we pay people more per hour, but we also got benefits, bro. Do they got benefit for you over here, man? Do they give you dental? Do they give you medical? No. No, they don't. No. They don't give a fuck about you, bro. You're you right? nothing but a goddamn worker, man. Nothing but a, mm. a fuck. You know what I'm saying? A button to the system. You feel me on that? I do kind of feel you, Andre. I'm not going to lie. I'm gonna tell you, man. Well, I'm not gonna like you kind of dress for the noodle shop. You know what I mean? Like, maybe you might have maybe not. Wait, what? You kind of dress like you work at the noodle shop. You know what I mean? No, 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 no. We ain't talking about a noodle shop, man. We talking about a taco okay, shop. You know what I'm saying? We, yeah, we talking about a taco shop. Now, listen. I'm gonna tell you this right now. This noodle shop is a sinking ship. You know what I'm saying? Oh. The workers ain't getting paid. No benefits. Mm. You know what I'm saying? The owners don't care about the place. They never hear. You know what I'm saying? The difference is, I'm one of the managers and part owners of the place, and I beat her all the time. You see what mm, I'm saying, I do man? I seeing you. I do That's the different. That's the different, man. That's the difference. Now, I'm going to just tell you guys right now, you don't got to say yes or no right now. I'm, I'm going to tell you guys, the door is open. I'm you know what I'm saying? If you guys uh, I, ever gonna, wanna... I, I already talked to Cal. I think uh, that was already also been told to me, and I was already going to help out anyway. But I'm not hired yet. Ooh, so okay. More okay, like, so Kyle gonna like, take care of you? Uh, Kyle said that do you or Ellie or um, I haven't officially met Ellie. I met uh, like you know I'm friends with Changing as well. Zolo. Um, no really? Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sweetie, okay, I'm well kidding. Ellie's right around the corner, so maybe we can introduce you to Ellie and we can see we can work something out. Does that sound Wait, good? What's your name? Who am I? Yeah, you. I name Peanut. Oh, I met your, um, your girlfriend. My girl, Hazel? Yeah. Yeah, nice. man, that's my, yeah, that's my little shoddy and all that, you know what I'm saying? She's a little ting, I'm not gonna lie. Hold on now. Yeah, we we okay, haven't pause. officially met, Wait. but yeah, we, Hazel talked about you as well. Like, oh, really? Yeah, we hung out really? a couple of times. Yeah, yeah, the good stuff, good stuff. Not all right, well, listen, Miss, uh, what's your name with the yellow hair? Sorry about that, I didn't Titty. catch the name. Titty? Titty? Mm -hmm. Tweety. Like, I think know. it might be Titty. Oh, Tweety like the bird or Titty like the tit? Yeah, Tweety like a bird. Oh, Tweety. All right, well, listen, Miss Tweety. You know what? Let's get you a... Uh, let's go talk to Ellie. We can introduce you and sit. You know what I'm saying? No worries. Yeah, yeah. All right, um, well, listen. Miss Orange, what's your name? Oh, my name is Finley. All right, well, Finley, like I said, the door is open. You know what I'm saying? Hit me up if you trying to, you know what I'm saying? If you interested. All right? Oh, I might be. I might be. All right, but stay that in. Mm. All right, you want to come over here real quick, Tweet the Bird? Yeah, yeah, give me one second. All right, no problem. Take your time. Gary, are you in the office? Are you in the office? Honestly, you know, I didn't really talk real quick. Yeah, I mean, I miss my old job. Search for me. I'm in there. Come, come to the every room. I need your number. It was great, man. We had a whole machine. All right, yo, listen. So I just spoke to this girl from like the rival businesses, okay? Mm -hmm. and, and apparently she good friends or like she friend she know Cal, she's friend with Zolo and all that. Her name Tweety mm -hmm. the Bird. And I'm okay. gonna introduce you to you, but I think she basically wanna walk up in here at a taco place. Only thing is though, she spoke actually let me bring Cal real quick. Cal spoke to her. Hold on. Yo, Cal, can you when you done, can you come up in here real quick? Yeah, alright, I'll catch up with you. Yeah, that shit's gas. 
Uh, so, okay, so. what did that girl say, by the way? Was she interested in working? Yeah, she just as she said, she said, well, Batar said I could, blah, blah, blah. That's cool and all, but, like, you need to talk to Peanut Me or Ellie regarding the booth. So, now, oh, Ellie, okay. Yep. People need to is... stop being like, you can work here when yeah. they're not in a position to say whether they can work here or not. Well, they think Chang Gang, and if someone in Chang Gang says it, you know what I mean? So and I just made it, it clear. It was Batar. I mean, I'm sure he meant no harm with it as Batar. Yeah. I said the only promise, just... only Go promise ahead. is that she wants to work at both shops. Nope. Who, that, right, no. Nope. Yeah, absolutely not. No. Nope. Who is it? All right. There's some girl named Tweeted Bird. She says she's friends no. with Zolo or something like that. Uh, I'll let I... her know. I'll let her yeah, know that no, if no, she no, wants to work happening. up here, she yeah, got so, so that's nope. a standard move forward. You can't work at more than one booth. Right. Yeah, no. It's, you don't okay. want to double dip. Uh, that, that's no, 100%. Been I'm yeah, saying there's people who have been doing it, and you can do it, but as long as we don't want to do it, I'm down. Our, yeah. our, our rule is you will not be working at multiple yeah. booths. Uh, Got it. Would, uh, if she was willing to quit, though, that other spot, would you be interested uh, in hearing her out with an interview or not? Me? Why? I, I would want to know why. Why. why would she want to work here over a job that she already well, has? Well, because she said she know she's friends with CG, is what she said. She said she's friends okay, with Zoe. Let's be real, CG's... Huge. Besides, like, us, CG's probably not going to be working here. I mean, I know that, but it's, I, I'm sorry. it's like a chaos I, CG maybe I'm, maybe I'm just, like, a little... You shouldn't want to work here just because CG is here. Like, that just seems... I mean, Ellie, but anyway. it's just, I mean, it's just... I mean, that's just how reality yeah, that is. That is going to be a big that, sell point for a gonna lot be of people, it. if I'm being that's real. Just, I mean, that's just how reality... Oh, <laughs> then they're that's here just, for that's the just wrong reality, reasons. Though. True. I mean, yeah, but it's... Uh, but if true, it's but... Let them I mean, lead themselves so, on. <laughs> I will say, when I used to interview people at Maldini's, I'd ask them, do you work at any of the restaurants? And they say, yeah, I'd be like, you'd have to quit there come work here. And I would hop people from, like, shit like, like, uo and everything. So, um, it really depends on how the interview goes. But, again, I'm not really in charge of employment. I'm just doing day-to-day. -day mm. so. But that's just my two cents added in. All right, now let me ask you guys. Are do we are we doing payments? Because some of these people are getting paid. Uh, we got we got to work that out, they, obviously, right? We, we will be yes. Ray and I are in talks about what the right amount would be. Oh, oh hey, how's it going, Tweety the Bird? How's it going? You, you doing okay, ma'am? Yeah. Are we okay. just having a we just having a quick oh, conversation? I'm, I'm so sorry. You good? Hey, you good? Sorry. You good? Well, that was her, by the way. Yeah. Kind of figured by the name. <laughs> Three to the bird is not a common name. She said she's getting paid two k an hour. Uh, yeah, how much you that? How much you think we'd be paying though if people work here? I really have no clue. It, it's Wait, really good. Two k is, is that a not lot or terrible. Little? No, it's not. I, on it, yeah. No, that's not bad. Like we could easily do two k. Yeah, how much do you think they'll sell think me about per hour? Well, see, we'd be, the way that it would be is we're going to have a clock-in system. Uh, there'd be an hourly rate. And honestly, I don't think we should be discussing pricing right off the bat because that's just going to be, like, another reason. Yeah. Like, obviously, they're going to get paid, um, but we want them to work here for more than just being paid is the thing. Yeah. Oh. Um, but it's it'll job, also though. depend on like how open we are. The we more should see that... how the first week goes before we yeah. decide on an hourly yeah. payment. Yeah. We're gonna look at numbers. It'll be weekly payouts, and we'll be tracking how many hours. You know those. You know those jobs in real life chat when they try to hire you for passion instead of money. <laughs> Why are you trying to work here, sir? Um, Peanut, to answer your uh, question. <clears throat> money. The biggest source of income for this stall is gonna be the Goober Eats people cleaning money. And the biggest burst is like on storm. Like everyone's left their money in their basket overnight. They wake up, they grab it, they do good reads and clean their money. So like, yeah, you can make 60, 50, 80. I've seen Bruce make 80K in the first two hours of storm being open for good reads. Yeah, like we're already up to 18 right hey, now. Hey, is Bruce still gonna be working over here? I mean, he was no. good, right? No. Yeah, I just let him go because I don't want more complication with him Bring, you know, I wanted to just. There was a bit a of drama. attitude and confrontation when the. Uh, I really re feel like if he got the chance, he was going to take that booth yes. out from underneath yeah, you. Yeah, I, I think so too. Hundred percent. Like I was ready to actually stab that motherfucker when he was. Standing but really, next what to happened? What, what was he saying? What, he what the way he was questioning. He's like, so, I know you guys went into deal, CG went into a deal with it, but like, what if I came in here and took this? And I, I bit my tongue. Wait, I was what? About to be like, well, yeah. he, he was basically asking, what if he came in and took the booth? I was, I was about to tell him like, I'll fucking kill you, but. 
I was like, I'm going to let them, you know, hash it out and shit like that. But he was like really dead set on it until then he saw Mateo and Marcel. Like he saw we ha we were here deep to make sure that we got the boot. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Yeah, what he... it, it was very much like one doesn't work out and you guys don't get it. Bruce, I'm going Cypress. for the pizza stall next. Like, it doesn't matter what anything or anyone says, like, I'm yeah. getting that. And tell Vinny that I'm going to run it and he's going to put a Mexican swing to it versus, you know, Italian. I don't know. It was, it was weird. Yeah. Yeah. Like it's, it's fucking pizza. Dude. And, then he was, and then he was like trying to make it seem like I'm a bad business partner because I was aggressive to him or something. Oh, you want to work with this guy, Kyle? Look at how uh, how aggressive he's being with me. Yeah, I don't know. Bruce, I listen, I've worked with Bruce multiple times, but that dude always, uh, I don't know. He always be on some bullshit. I ain't going to lie. I don't, I don't know, Bruce. So I, I, I just didn't like the way. It really sounded like he was like trying to scheme a way to take the taco booth out from underneath yeah. Cal. He's yeah. like, well, if you're not here, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, oh, he's going to be here and we're all going to be here. Like we stayed up hours after to make sure that like it didn't. Yeah. Yep. Become available in that store. Uh, I was but, like 5:30 a.m. or some shit. Yeah. Hey, uh, hey, what's it called, Ellie? So that girl that I was talking about, would you want to even hear her out if she quit her job or not? Yeah, I'm. I'm definitely open to hearing her out for sure. I bet I'll go but talk I, to her and see what's up. I, right? I would say do the interview before you tell her to quit. You know what I mean? Like yeah. That, that's like the closing deal. If you guys like what she has to say and all that, be like, all right, listen, we do have kind of a thing. Like, we don't want like. You, know, you you could put it up to it, it's it's upper management that says it. They don't want like you know, because that has been a rule with me forever. Is yeah, it did, that was, that like, didn't no, go well. Huh? You're not gonna work multiple places. You're not gonna double dip. I don't like it. It's just I I feel like especially with What's us up, being Art? all in the same fucking building. You know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah. that's just my my stance on it. She doesn't want to quit, then you know that's what it is. Okay, Ellie, you want to bring her in and see what's up? Little, little yeah, yeah bring her in. We can all have a chat with her. What are we going to be doing interviews? Just, I guess, in this office room? Sure. Yeah, we could do it in there, yeah. I I call the problem is, uh, only problem is random ass people coming in, but... Yeah. All right, yo, hey, Tweety, would you, uh, would you be okay with doing an interview? Yeah. All right, come on, Tweety. They're, they're waiting to be served. Um, I, I, I... Cause. Cause. Oh! Okay, just wait for me in this room. I'll be right back right here, okay? Sure, sure, sure. All right, let me know. Let me let him know. <laughs> Yo, Ellie, come on. We gotta go do the interview. Come on. Oh, that is Harris everything? wants to I'm job, too. Okay, Amazing. we'll do, we'll do both interviews. Yeah, All right, come fast on. Food, I already did the like... one. <laughs> That's how it's done, bro. That's how it's done. I've been talking that motherfucker out of so long. Hey, how's it going, Tweety? This Hi. is Ellie. Ellie, this is Tweety. Nice how's it going? Ellie, how's it going? Doing good, doing good. Okay, okay. So, Tweety over here, she works at the noodle shop, you know what I'm saying? And she basically and wanted house. to get a job. What'd you say? And fun house. Wait, so you... Hold on there, let me get this straight. You work at two shops ready? Yeah. Great. That's sad. But it's, um... I know it might be bad, but, um... So, I already... I wish... I wish Patar was around. Um... I already spoke with Patar even regarding to the business in general. So it's it's kind of like me and Patar are also dealing with the businesses that helps the Chang Gang as well. Um, in general, to basically get you guys going and with whatever you need. I'm like a pure blood uh, civilian for now. And the reason why I say for now is until the opportunities comes up. And for me, the reason why I'd like to help out is not necessarily for a uh, malicious reason or anything like that. I'm a very unbiased person and, uh, right. and I'm not going right. to sabotage any of the businesses. I do purely like uh, to the honest and truthfully. Um, and I would understand, I understand that like that might be kind of like, you know, uh, might be bad, I guess. It depends on like how you guys would view it. But um, I've already like discuss this kind of um, situation as well that like you know I'm, I'm I don't think Ellie's rocking with it the businesses basically I don't think so Ellie... if you guys need any help or like even regarding farming and etc I have experience in all of them I have experience in accounting as well like uh, payrolls I have experience in 
a lot of different basically ways. And so you if, there, if I see yes, if I see like a stall close that I'm working, um, I will prioritize that stall um, more than any other stalls. Does it make sense? Like yeah, that makes sense. Um, right. Yeah. Okay, well, listen, Tweety, I'll be honest with you, man. I'm giving you the interview because you got a voucher by Zello, and he said he'd cool with you, you know what I'm saying? He said he'd give you a chance. So, obviously, I still want to give you a chance regardless of whatever happens. Sure, now, 100%. I will not. Okay, time. so I just got a few questions for you, okay? Before mm -hmm. I tell you if you got a job or not, or you know what I'm saying? Now, what makes you better than every single worker up in here at Senior Blunts? You know what I'm saying? What makes you better than all these people over here? I'm capable of working 43 hours per week. 43 hours? Given. Yes. Even okay. More, actually. Uh, Damn. My record was 42 hours. Uh, sorry, my, uh, my record is 43 and a half hours. Uh, one in a week. And then the next week after that, it was 42 hours. So I'm able to, like, consistently going. And then the next, the, the week after that <laughs> was 36 hours because we, uh, well, I was busy making the menu <laughs> items. So if you guys also um, need like any menu items to be designed, I'm also an illustrator and designer. Um, Damn, I'm dude. Yeah. I so like you a jack of all fucking sure. trades over here, man. Yeah. Uh, if you guys want to see my portfolio in terms of like menu items, I can also provide that for you. If you guys are interested to do banners or um, like uh, advertisement posters or even like many items like to make your tacos looking delicious and all that i can actually show you people if you, if you are interested and um yeah i hold it down basically okay now let me ask you you said you worked at the so the noodle shop and the fun house correct is there any other yeah. jobs or no that you work at um uh, the, the other jobs is lumber but that's uh remote like i don't need to be there okay that makes sense okay fair enough okay Okay, how long have you been working in these stalls? Like, how long is your experience? Um, four and a half months. Four and a half months, so it's been a while. Yeah. Okay. Uh, are you game related? No. You got no ties to nobody? No. Like, I'm, okay. I have friends from everybody. Like, every, like not every game. I mean, I don't really... Um, like, yeah. Uh, clowns consider me as found friends, but uh, because one of them, I dated one of them, and he no longer is here. Um, so that oh, like, Ellie's go. Ellie don't like this. Like necessarily make me really like affiliated, as you would say. It's only my relationship with the clowns would be only work. Okay. Work All right, Ellie. You have any questions? Sure. Uh, no. I think it's like a conversation that we'll all have together after. I'm just taking everything in. <laughs> okay. Would you me. be willing to quit and only work at one stall? Um, I would say yes. Depend uh, obviously, it would basically, I would have to measure like what uh, benefits I'm going to get from the, a stall and stuff. Because I don't think that I'm going to be working for too long. Um, uh, there is uh, something happened today that uh, kind of gave like a negative uh, input for me to work at the fun house because um, uh, I know Rami's uh, also you guys a friend and I already talked to Zola about it but Rami put uh, put a hit on me uh, not knowing that it's <laughs> me even though we met once uh, when we were doing moonshine <laughs> um, that like of my head to be 25k and then uh, two people like tried to come into the fun house and basically incapacitate me. Um, what the fuck? So uh, there's a lot of stuff that happened in fun house that we just not um, in terms of like principle and just work related. Um, yeah, I'm I'm on like a very silver lining with them basically. Um, so I would say I don't think that you should be worried about fun house that much because. I'm gonna see what they're they're gonna do or how all of these situations gonna be resolved. If not, then I'm gonna take my business somewhere else. Because, like I said, I'm not. Uh, it's I'm doing it for a help. I'm not even getting good payments, and because I'm not necessarily looking for only hey, money. Calm down. I'm looking for 
a good opportunity is that I can have a good connection and you know uh, with people in general like they can trust me with any any other upcoming businesses for the city and I know that uh, either Nino I'm pretty sure Nino's gonna win in any um, they're gonna be like more business opening up anyways so alright okay I'll focus on that yeah. okay are you got any questions uh no I'm just listening Okay, Miss Tweety. Uh, can you give us one second? You just step out for one second. Sure, sure, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, no problem. Thanks so much. Uh, right, yo, listen. I ain't gonna lie, dude. A friend that's somebody that's friends with everybody is friends with nobody. That yeah, girl got too many fucking ties, bro. Holy yeah, shit! Yeah, when you spread your shit too thin, type shit. You got way too many fucking friends. I think I don't know. We should give her a chance. But I think the only way we would give her a chance is she basically she has to quit everywhere. She has to only work at. Also, why did Rami? She said something about Rami put out a hit on her for twenty five thousand. Oh, he put a hit out for anyone on the the fun house. It was kind of funny actually. Hey, okay. oh, so it's some because shit. they're voting for us. Wild, though. Hang on, I gotta. Work. Yeah, that's all that was. Um, I, I mean, like civilian jobs, I don't give a shit about. It. It's just food jobs is where I think she needs to quit. You know. So do you think uh so do you think if right, she's doing like lumber g6 and all that i don't give a damn about that like that's whatever but right, working for direct competition okay. i gotta yeah, go talk to Kay. No. i'll be back ray you disgusting okay right. well, what do you think ray i mean what do you think Kyle? if she if she's willing to quit both her jobs and work her next only... her next question would be what is she getting paid well we can't even give her that answer yet so she's also gonna be willing to like have to wait a couple days for us to figure out a wage yeah that's the biggest thing is like you know, that's why I said don't tell her to quit anything until I think she was talking about the funhouse girl. Yo, you sir, thank you for the tier one. Seven right months. Now is like Cyril. a good period to get a good judgment of people, right? Um, tell her yeah. like, hey, we'll get back to you in a couple. Like we're we're just like restructuring and all that stuff because it's also if you start hounding me for a job nonstop, I'm less likely to you know bring you on. But if you like. Every once in a while, like, hey, you know, just so you know, I'm still around, blah, 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 blah. I'm cool with that. But if you're, like, constantly fucking, like, coming at me when we're trying to get shit figured out, you know? Yeah. So that, that that's a big thing. Um, it, It's really, like, what what kind of vibe did you get, though? Uh, I mean, I don't think she's a bad person. I think she's cool. I just think that, like I said, I just think she's friends with too many people. Yeah. To the point where that will cause problems. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it that's heads. where the expectation of free food comes into play. And people have to be willing to, like, not fall for that. You know what I mean? All right. So, if I mean, so listen, if she was willing to quit the other jobs, do you think we should give her a chance or not? I Yeah. If she's willing to quit those places, yes. I, that, that, Dang. I mean, there is that possibility then, though, that something could come up where she ends up quitting our. You know, quitting our company, but that it is what it is. That I mean, listen, is there any way we can get fucked? Like, is there any way? Like, let's say she quits both her jobs. Like, if we hire her to the food place, like, what could, what's the worst she could do? I mean, she can't take, take the money. All the food. She, she can't take the money. Food. We, the only person who could touch the money is uh, Cal. Like, okay. nobody, yeah. not even management, can touch that. We can see how much the booth is made, but we're not allowed to touch it. So, um, worst thing she could do is take the food. We have our own farms. Beef is not hard. It this ain't like five years ago where I had to go and kill fucking cows myself to get it. So okay, I'm so not nothing really crazy. worried about she, she no, can't, it's uh, nothing uh, crazy at all. Uh, if anything, just, it's just putting a target on her back. Yeah, 100%. And she stands out. <laughs> well, listen, if she says she wanna work crazy hours, I think we just tell her That's we, a good we tell thing. Her straight that, up. that to me perked my in interest. Yeah, we tell her straight so. up though. We tell her, hey, listen, if you uh if you quit both those jobs, we'd be unwilling to give you a chance, most likely. Or, yeah. or should we just tell, should we say that, or should we just tell her like, "Hey, we'll get back to you in a little bit." Like, Would say to... like, "Listen, we're tr we're still trying to uh, figure out pay because that that's one thing." Like, I go I go back to work tomorrow, but me and Ellie are going to be talking through emails and shit like that, uh, trying to get um, pay figured out. Ah, uh, but like I said though, regardless of the pay, shit, I'm saying, do you want to like? If she quit her jobs right now, would, would you want to hire her right now? Or should we just tell her to, we'll, tell, we'll have an answer later? I mean, that's your call. Do you think she'd be willing to quit right now, not knowing what she's going to get paid per hour? 
Exactly. That's that's, the that's, thing. that's why I'm saying. I mean, so we could just be straight up. I mean, I'm just gonna tell her straight up. Like, I'm gonna just tell her how it is. I'm not trying to sugarcoat shit. I'm not trying to, yeah. you know. Yeah, I'll tell her, and if she's willing to do it, then we'll do it. If she yeah, don't, then, if she's willing then to she do it, we'll hire her on and get her working. Yeah, I'm all fine right, with let it. Me, let me, all right, let me bring her in. All right, cool. <clears throat> all right, yo, hey, Tweety. Uh, can you come over real quick? Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, so Rayma, I, I will say. Oh, hold on, hold on. Wait right there. Yeah. One second. Okay. I'm much more busy uh, in the early hours. That makes sense. Oh, look, it's my fucking opposition. Yeah. What's up, stupid? Oh, uh, yeah, the other Stupid up, ass, Slim up. Shady. Yeah, okay, stupid okay, ass, okay. Slim Shady. Yeah, you suck. Okay, really? Okay, okay. okay. Alright, sorry about that. Okay, alright. Come in here. Alright, so listen, Tweety. Uh. I'm gonna agree with you. I ain't gonna sugarcoat shit. I like some of your answers. I respect that, you know, you put in work, you put in uh, time, you got the experience and all that. You know what you're doing. I respect mm -hmm. that 100%. You a hard worker, it seems like. Now, I'll be real with you, okay? When we hire people, we uh we don't really like the whole working at multiple places, as in stalls. You can work, you know, lumber, you can do G6, whatever the hell you want to do. But I I'm gonna shoot straight. If we... Hold on. Hey, 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 Get the fuck up out of you. Uh, my bad, my bad. Uh, so, yeah, like I was saying, if we finna hire you, if you want this job, you would have to quit both the other stalls. Now, if you don't want to do that, that's 100% fine. We understand, and we, we're not going to hold it against you or nothing, no bad blood, nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? But if you do want to work with us, you would have to quit the other stalls, and uh, it's up to you at the end of the day. Like I said, I gave you the interview because Zolo vouched for you, and some of my boys fuck with you. It's up to you. Now, if you do um, quit, we'll hire you on the spot. I have a quick question. Regarding All right, what's that? Is, um, so the, is the burrito that place that you guys are uh, basically taking, is that going to be also a business uh, eventually? What, like the food or is stall? This, is this just a stall? Yeah. Oh, uh, it's I mean, it is, it is business, but like, there's no point in even doing that because... All the traffic is at the stall, and the Uber Eats is at the stall. So, like, even if even I got a business license, bought a property, you know what I mean? It'd be hard to even. Well, the reason why I'm asking sites, that so, because, um... Hold on, dude. Hold on. Yeah. Take over, Ellie. I'm sorry. Oh, Ray, take over because I. Yo, what's going on, Kay? Yo, what you doing, dude? Right, what you mean? What am I doing, dude? You gave permission for me to be a manager. So guess what I'm doing, bro? I'm getting this shit lit. I'm hiring oh, people. I, I, I got I movement. Uh... Yeah, I'm, I'm inside the admin room, bro. Oh, I didn't see. Okay, we doing a we doing an interview with a girl right now that says she could work like forty hours, bro. I'm trying to get some people, man. I'm trying to get some okay, traffic fuck. and all that, bro. Bro, listen. With this stall, we gonna be making fucking money, man. Money. We printing money over here, man. We gonna be the best yeah. all around here. I already got so hey, we gonna host some food contests too, man. We could host some live prizes, bro. Whoever could down some tacos with no chewing is gonna win. Oh like that. shit, you, you might win that. Shit, a hundred percent. We'll rig it. I'll win this shit, so we don't gotta pay nothing. Easy clap. You know what I'm saying? What you up to, man? Vote Nino Chavez and yeah. Bobby Charles. What's going on, guys? Sorry, we're we'll past a group of people. You, call, you coming oh. down to see your What you doing? Yeah, I'm coming down and then, um... Alright, I'm coming down, actually. I bet. I'll see you over there. I'll let it. Any time of the day, yeah, you can yeah, run my. It's pockets. more of um the the working at multiple stalls. That's kind of like a thing that I came up with uh, five years ago. I used to run Maldini's, and it wasn't because of stealing this net. It's more, it's hard to keep people motivated to help us, you know, continue the business when taco, you know, <laughs> taco it, my very long distance uh, relative was working in Maldini's. Yeah. Uh, yeah living so, nightmare. Okay. Okay, so they, they can fill you in on like it's it's I'm very passionate about it um, and it's kind of more if there is a struggle for three like if, if anything changes where you know it be you know our farms all collapse and, and the state has to step in it's gonna be how can we maintain the coverage in this and that if you have multiple jobs at multiple stalls 
there's an expectation there. Oh, why is she, why is she over there and not over here? You know what I mean? Um, it, it's not more about food getting stolen. It, it's if that that happens, that happens. It's whatever. It's more just uh, we want to make sure that you're. It, you're dedicated to us. Yeah, yes, exactly. You're dedicated to our side of the thing. Um, so it, it's more just. Yeah, it also shows dedication. Like, yeah, listen, I, I'm willing to, you know, go 100% in with you guys. You know what I mean? No, 100%. That's why I said that, like, um, when I asked the question um, regarding to the, um, um, like, if it's only stall related, um, because stall can be taken for any other people oh, as well, right? So it's mostly, um, that's why I was asking that, because otherwise, um, uh, Patar was also saying that like there's going to be like a cabal business coming out soon and oh, I, I already I have no idea about that, that that's... yeah yeah so it, if you end up going and helping with that that's within the quote-unquote family i don't see a problem with that yeah that's what um, i'm that's literally what what i'm waiting like it's not what i'm waiting we're, we're waiting for um the mayor nino to get selected basically uh -huh. which i also voted for uh because of patar uh, because he said that like once he get voted um we will have like a business uh proposal done and uh Yo, dude, what is get, you looking at dude? Uh, we're just we're, we're looking for a residential like a property uh to buy the place and then i'll what be the also running crying? that hold on yeah yeah um, <laughs> hey 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 yo hey, bring that shit up out of here man we having a business meeting man get that shit up out of here all i wanted was some tacos